yeah um that's true we have so many um online comics example the great Lassie Sieleno, the great Brother Shaggy, um, the great uh, Ima, oh my God, SLK. There are several guys, several guys there. And um, I think what makes me unique is number one, spontaneity. Spontaneity. I'm very, very spontaneous. And number two, but they are spontaneous. I'm very spontaneous. Number two, you, you won't see me coming. You understand? There are some comedy skits that you can almost tell the end from the beginning. You 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 can't even predict where I'm going to land. That's number two. Number three, um, you my content my content here. I rated general. It's something you want to play in the church. Something you can play in a mosque. Something the kids can relate to. Something the adults can relate to. Something that um, something you want to share in the office environment just to cool down the. Uh, official attention so that's just it this life in itself you just have to metamorphose I don't know what that means but you fit into whatever <laughs> you just have to is it evolve you really have to evolve you can't do the same thing and expect different result okay if you do stand-up comedy here yeah, probably one at Moson center um it's possible that your your outreach is limited to those that came for the show you understand and probably those that will see it on youtube but if you do if you do um an instagram skit now in the next few seconds someone in us in uk russia they can view that same skit you understand so instagram is taking over because it has a wider outreach it has a wider outreach example i went to the u.s embassy for the first time even though they denied me in jesus name i went there and the lady said um, i know you the first person i interviewed me you did one skit you did one skit i have i went to ghana and when i got to the airport i saw people coming to take pictures with me you understand that is instagram for you as i mean i was just restricted to a comedy show on, um, I went to a comedy event. My brother, how many people won't know me except for those in my country? You get so it's taking over. That is how you see um, some some um, transport companies now are now online taking job for the normal taxis that we know. You get um, everything just have to evolve. Now you guys are online TV, right? It's an online TV. If those that don't have light at home. They don't have that their tv is not functioning because there's no light they can easily go mobile and watch you guys but for the normal terrestrial tv if no tv no show for the audience you understand what i'm trying to say so that's just it i won't say there is i won't just like to use money money that word there is wealth in comedy okay comedy is another form of um it's, it's it's a different oil on its own okay that's why you see so many people delve into comedy you understand everyone wants to be happy what will be what will be an event without a comedian so there's good money there's good pay you understand there's endorsement in comedy there is there's everything there's money in comedy you see people making millions millions um, in a month so there's good money in comedy as long as you're good at what you do It's more, you can't use money when we can say wealth, as in, you can't use just money to quantify wealth. You understand? Do you know the resources, okay? Um, like people will say, your network, your network is your net worth. You understand? As a comedian, you meet people, you meet different people. You get connected. Look at the network, look at the network. It's so rich to understand that if you decide to attribute that, convert it into money. It's, it's crazy. You understand? So there's, there's money. This world, it is very, very rich. It's very, very resourceful to be a comedian. It is. There's more to it. You understand? I never knew you before, but now because of what I do as a comedian, yet I have known another person in my life now, who is changing my career by bringing me life on Broadway TV, giving me the, giving me, giving me the outreach that I might, I might not have. You understand? So there is money in comedy.
all those people that say men has come, men has come, men has come. And why must you try men? Why can't you just try one man? Must you be going up and down? Eh? If one man break your heart, go another man break your heart, throw down, break your heart. Don't you even think the problem might be from you? Yes, some we men, we are like angels. Okay, we men, we are God sent. You understand? We men, ladies, they don't appreciate the essence of men. Do you know that when you have a man beside you, you're confident, you feel secured, you feel cared for, catered for. You understand? So, men has come. Anybody who says men has come, that person is an ungrateful man. Do you understand? Very, very ungrateful. Men are unscum. They are inscomable. The house. <laughs> Um, a female celebrity, because before it was in that cage, yeah, or it didn't work out, and people were saying that when she got pregnant, they were saying, Oh, I'm not impregnated. No, 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 no. Even though I appreciate the fact that they, okay, hello, is it your say? I said, People said I impregnated that, and people thank you for wishing me good that much, but that's not my baby and all that. So, my, presently, my female celebrity coach is um, R2. One is Toke Makinwa, and the other is CC. I lost someone that would change it for me. Have you seen Sissy Beaters? You understand? Someone that would, I'm always playful, you understand? Someone that whenever I'm with her, I just, you understand? I can't play. You understand? And Toke Makwa, she's good in betting. She just won $20,000. You understand? Imagine having a wife that can predict, that can bet. She'll just pick any, any of those soccer betting team, pick us and win. Man, you win. And we we'll put our family money, ten thousand dollars. We 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 make money. You understand? Talking talking about you saw what she posted. She she just won twenty thousand dollar bet. Uh, how much bet? Twenty thousand dollars. Is it twenty thousand dollars? Twenty thousand dollars bet. So that is the kind of wife I want. Talking about tomorrow you better and we go continue. One go is your able. You understand? No, that's why you say you need someone that is better than you. Mm. You need someone that is better than you. That means you understand your woman is supposed to be better than you. I'm saying you need a woman way better, pass you, better. Hmm. Hmm. Hold deep, hold deep, hold deep, hold deep. Okay, you a better woman. <laughs> I'm a better. You <laughs> my Mean good in bed is a food on his own. Yes, you need to know all these things. You understand? Someone that cannot cook, eh, but is good in bed. And someone that can cook, but is not good in bed. No, 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 no. She doesn't have to cook. You understand? That's how we have each other. We buy food. We have ourselves that cook. Do you know what being good in bed is? Even though I'm a virgin, I know people just talk about it and they say it is something that you, it's, it, it's worth waiting for. It's good. Imagine waiting all my life now. As I'm looking at me, I'm over 23. You understand? I'm a little bit over 22. I'm, I'm over 23. I'm not getting married. And I will not stay married as someone that cannot be good in bed. No, 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 no. no, no. I don't deserve that. And is that someone that will kill me? Let me just die. Finish me. My show is coming up on the 19th of August. Um, a month from now, at Muson Center. It's called Funny Enough with Mr. Ayanana. And um, it's going to be crazy. It's a jungle themed event, okay? And you come there, you see lots of trees, lots of. Um, it's possible to see an Ayana. Trust me, we're planning on something. And um, we got we got comedians like Ali Baba, Okay, Bakasi is coming, coming on stage, Julius Agu, um, Funny Bone, Sheila, Kenny Black, Akbo, Brother Shaggy, Lassie Eleno, Ima, oh my God, they say, okay, D1. And the show will be hosted by no other person but Toby or Big Brother Naija. It's my show, guys. You will see a different side of me that day. She may not funny for this industry. We've come to take over. We've been around for a while, 12, 13 years now, on a low key, unblowable. But now that we're blown, we will uh, You should come see the best part of me, okay? And ticket is very, very affordable. Ticket is like 5,000. Ticket is 10,000. Table is 500,000. If you pay 400,000, we'll give you. The table will not be new. But if you pay, if you pay ten thousand now, and you don't have ten thousand, but you have eight five, 
and then H5 is still good for me. I can use it to do something good in my life. So you guys just come. Tell your friends to tell their friends. And tell your enemies also. Because if your enemy is happy, if you get a better thing to do, you're not going to wallow your life. Yes, and so tell everybody that Mr. Ayanana, funny enough with Ayanana, something different, something unique. Watch out. But imagine me collecting all money for tickets and now jar. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. Just watch out. Watch out.